Hey everybody, welcome to my channel, Single Cylinder Sights. I'm Levi. Um, I had a question from my buddy Zach wanting to uh, see the setup I use for a camera and a microphone. So that's what this video is. It's just going to be a quick one. Um, here's the helmet I've been riding with. Um, I'll put a still pick in that shows it a little, maybe a little more clearly. But um, I use a Hero 7 Black from GoPro. And that's been pretty good. I like it a lot. Um, <clears throat> I had done a lot of uh, research for a microphone and um, one that came highly recommended by everybody who was doing recording or about 80% of the people that I read reviews from was this Purple Panda microphone. Uh, so I ordered that. It's about 40 bucks, maybe a little more give or, t you know, give or take who you order it from. I ordered it on Amazon. Um, and I've enjoyed it now that I got it working. I want to address uh, real quick that I, I had a problem at the beginning and there there's a half dozen or so videos out there of people trying to address the different problems you can have with you plug the mic in it doesn't work. And uh, I was a little nervous at first because this is actually my second GoPro. The first one I came home with wouldn't even hold the charge. I couldn't get the camera to turn on. So I had to return it. Came home with the second one once everything came in the mail from Amazon um, to include you know the bigger the bigger camera mount because you have to get this aftermarket part uh, you can't just plug a microphone right into GoPro they have their own accessory and that's kind of a bulky item so it, it goes in the bottom of this plastic mount that I got from Artman um, so once you get that thing plugged in you then plug the camera into that secondary device and that plugs in via the uh, USB-C port or whatever you call it and then you're supposed to be in business so I couldn't get a sound out of my microphone so I googled it read some articles, watched some videos um, tried three or four things that people recommended to include shutting off Bluetooth shutting off my Wi-Fi um, some people said there, there's a configuration where you can have it so that the moment you hit the power button on your GoPro it automatically starts recording but apparently your microphone won't activate at that point. I checked that in my menu, I forget what it's called, but mine had never been turned on so that wasn't the problem but I still wasn't getting any sound at all. Um, so I thought I had, you know, either the GoPro was defective in a different way than the first one or I got a defective mic and I didn't want to spend another forty dollars on a mic so I actually went on to Amazon and I ordered this pop voice mic for $9.99 um, which I, I've yet to use <clears throat> while I was waiting for that to come in I took my Rode microphone off of my Canon DSLR which is what you hear recording right now and I plugged that in and I had voice right away. So I tried to figure out what the difference was and when I listened to the audio back of me plugging and unplugging my Purple Panda mic you know into the side of the setup for the GoPro you could definitely hear something so I knew that the jack was picking something up but it wasn't working. So when I looked at the difference of the jack between the Purple Panda and the Rode, I saw that the Purple Panda, and nobody, I didn't find any videos discussing this, but the Purple Panda has three of these rubber rings that separate the conductive components of the input, and the Rode can, uh, microphone, the Rode microphone only had two of those. And so before, the, uh, before my second mic that I ordered even came in, I started going through the Purple Panda bag because it comes with quite a few accessories. And one of them is this three inch adapter that takes it from, you know, technical term, three rubber rings down to two. The moment I put this on, my Purple Panda mic started working with the Hero 7 flawlessly. So that's what I've used in a couple of videos that I've uploaded to my YouTube channel. 
it's the purple panda with this extension that allows the GoPro to pick up the you know the microphone I'm using um, <clears throat> so other than that I had ordered a kit that comes with an arm you can mount onto your helmet you know that you use the 3M double sided uh, tape it puts the GoPro right in front of your chin area so that people get point of view as you're going down the road which I have found through comments that people have left uh, on other channels and my own personal preference I, I like that the best out of all the views of people riding motorcycles or doing moto vlogs is that that point of view camera is kind of the most important um, as I go on I'll pick up other cameras to get different angles as uh, b-roll footage but you know that's how I have everything set up so far um, I am going to do a test today's kind of a crappy day out so I haven't ridden a bike but tomorrow's supposed to be really nice I'm actually going to take it for a ride and test how the purple panda sounds against the pop voice mic and see you know one's forty dollars one's ten bucks um, so if they're pretty comparable you know, I would suggest saving yourself 30 bucks and just going with the the pop voice because it does it doesn't come with as many uh, accessories, but it does come with one of those little um, attachments that'll convert that mic as well. So you'll definitely be able to use that. Uh, you should definitely be able to use that to record any audio you want while you're wearing your helmet. I just wanted to show that as someone not having any prior experience sometimes it's the simplest thing and in this case it was the input jack that was causing the problem with with no voice being picked up. Uh, so I, I think that's where this video stands out from the other ones and hopefully it helps somebody along the line figure out why their microphone might not be working with their GoPro. Anyways, this is Levi. Thanks for watching. Hopefully I'll see you on the next ride.